trees shredded, homes hammered, cars crushed. Hurricane Zeta leaving behind devastation in Georgia. It's one of many storms that rolled through the U.S. last year. So could we see the same destruction in 2021? CBS 46's Fred Campagna takes a look at the hurricane forecast. The 2020 hurricane season was one for the record books with an astounding 30 named storms and 11 of those storms making landfall in the United States. Here we are on the cusp of the 2021 season and early forecasts are for another active year. A new storm formed at an average of once a week during last hurricane season. A La Nina pattern fed the active season. And while it's gone this year, an El Nino, which limits activity, has not formed. Hurricane experts see another active year. NOAA's chances of an El Nino are less than 10 percent. So that obviously can pose quite problematic still um, if the tropical Atlantic is much warmer than normal. At this point, the tropical Atlantic is near normal. But just north of the tropics, the water is unusually warm. And by the peak of hurricane season, that could translate south to the tropics. Back to 2020. Just this week, the National Hurricane Center upgraded Hurricane Zeta from a Category 2 to a Category 3 hurricane at landfall last October. That storm went on to wreak havoc in Georgia, killing three people and leaving millions without electricity. During this off-season, Georgia Power has been working hard to strengthen our power grid. We understand you know, how critical electricity is now because our homes have become our, our home, our safe place, and our schools, our office, and so folks need their electricity. A big part of hurricane prep comes now, long before a storm threatens your home. Build an emergency kit. In my kit, I have food. I have sanitary devices, especially now important during the pandemic. You know, we even have things like lights in our emergency kits. The important thing about this is that you have a plan. Even if this season is not as active as last year, all it takes is one storm. And that's why a good plan is so important. Georgia Power has a section on their website with lots of good tips, and I've linked to it from CBS46.com, and you can find it on the CBS46 app. Fred Campagna, CBS 46 News.